Yeah, very cool. So yeah. um, we do have toolboxes around. Uh -huh. um, and like like in your tour, we did create little 3D printed yeah. to um, create or separate the different end mills. Right, and I love that. Tapping drills. After and, our most recent tour? Yes. Like, yeah, that's yes. awesome. That's and great. so um, we do have labels that tell you that we have tap drills and we even yes, got the Yes, I love it. The foam. So how um, long did this take? Like, I know how long 3D printing takes, but you had to like get multiple people together yes. to say, okay, we got to just do this. Yes. Yeah. So it took about, I want to say about three weeks. Okay. Uh, just because of the 3D printing time and yeah. stuff like that. Um, but it honestly didn't take that long. Okay. Um, so beside the time it takes the 3D print, like if you could snap your fingers and have one of these organizers, would it have taken like maybe two weeks, one week? Yeah. And these are much. students that this is their part-time kind of job, right? Yes, yes. Okay. So I'm ch just trying to think if a, if a shop did this just every morning for maybe 20, 30 minutes for just a short period of time, they could make little improvements and change one massive work area, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So that's what we try to do. And then if you guys walk over here, 